All right, Chris. Be Holgar. It would really be helpful if you'd send me links to these videos when there's still a demo up. There is no demo for this game. This game is out. My faith in you is so resolute. I have paid eight dollars. This better be worth eight bucks. Ah, <sighs> it looks cool. He's got a nice retro aesthetic there. Let's see if this is the kind of game that, like, ten-year-old me wished existed on the NES. Slot one. In the deep lake, a barbarian was rowing towards the ancient land of his birth with his sword shining. Yeah, I can't do that voice for her. In the moonlight. Oh my god. Long time. He had the excitement of returning to the lands he left exactly 20 winters ago. As the mist cleared, that ominous tower that was piercing the sky caught his eye. Ooh, that rhymes. What the hell was that? <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, when everything would become clear. All right. That's all the story I need. And that's all the story I get. Oh. I think I only have... Yeah, I only got three of those left. Alright, so... Don't throw daggers. Music's not bad. Alright, so we got... Jump. Oh! It's like a little roll move. You have no other weapon. Can I... No, oh, shoot. I cannot use the shield. Okay. Castlevania-ish? Nope. Alright. Press A. Yeah. Can I go in there? Tapping up does nothing. All right. Ah, Beholgar, welcome. It's been a long time, hasn't it? Camasp. Bad news. As a sudden letter, Hagma is back. Oh, much stronger now. Spread everywhere. There's dark armies. Scourge almost everywhere. Oh boy. So pushing down will stop the slow scroll of the text. Or up. Any directional button, it seems. Alright, convince the dragon. Get the curse under control. Tough and grueling. Alright. Can you talk to him again? Yes. And he will just repeat everything. Okay. Oh, I can go in places. Ooh, look at the scroll in. Okay. Whoa. That's weird. The screen, like, jitters a little bit when you jump. Alright, there is nothing to do in there. But, whatever, it's fine. Oh, but, but. Oh my god. I've been saying it since yesterday. A thief broke into my house and stole my necklace, but no one cares about it. It was my heirloom that I kept for my rainy days. If you find it, please bring it to me. Do not worry. I will surely repay you for that. No, I'm, oh my god, I'm trapped in a loop. Yeah, blacksmith here. Welcome, warrior. We never go very far. Ah, do, 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 do. Please bring me a crystal. A hundred bucks for a projectile. I don't have that kind of scratch. He's got a nice run animation. It's not bad. All right, so it's throwing me off a little bit. A is jump, B is attack. Usually A for action would be the attack, and B would be more your jump, or like X. I mean, I'm talking all on like Xbox controls, but if it was an old school Super Nintendo, it's like, oh, God. 
and there goes the rest of my projectiles. <sighs> All right, so options. Redefine keys. Oh, boy. So, if it was me, melee would be replace, press a button, X is already in use. Yes, replace it. I think I did that right. Okay. So we're going to find out in a second here. So I've changed a couple of the controls really quickly here because that was going to drive me mad. There we go. So now the equivalent of like the Y button on a Super Nintendo is the attack. B is jump. And what would have been like the A button on a Super Nintendo, so the B on this, but that far part of the diamond, that's throwing a dagger because that's what you'd associate with a special attack. I know it seems nitpicky, but honestly, controller placement matters. The most logical place for where your thumb is resting should be your attack and your jump. And you rest on this part of the diamond, the part closest to the left side of you. <sighs> if the developers are listening, you chose the wrong button for your normal attack. Inventory, press back. Okay, what is... You have no other weapon. What is back? Like, backspace? So... I'm not trying to be nitpicky, but... What? Okay, inventory, press tab. Press back. It says press back, but it's press tab. Also, I can't find a button on the controller that goes to inventory. That's kind of annoying. Oh, all right, so you save at the fire. Makes sense. Fire, press B. Not anymore, I changed that. Melee attack, press X. Oh wait, no, no, fire, press, yeah, press B. Okay, so it, it does actually update with what I did. That's all right. Um, rolling, right trigger. Okay. Whoa! And we are getting right into it. Ha <laughs> ha! I got my projectiles back! Cool. Alright. Now I don't feel so bad about wasting them. Up and attack. Ow! Oh, well, I have none, so I'm not going to be able to do that. You just wait till I come back with projectiles. Well, if I had to guess, spikes are an instant kill. Oh! Alright, so it'd be nice if the enemy, like, oh, they, okay, they do stagger a tiny bit, not much. <laughs> ah, I should have hit that save. All right, round two. I got gold now, or gems or something. Whoa! Oh! Get him! Okay, so let's try this again. Yes! Okay. That's not so bad. Got some of my health back with some apples. And I am still firmly convinced that these spikes will be an instant... Walking into the dude hurt me. No! I don't suppose any of you boys could drop me an apple. Oh, I, it looks like I jumped right into that. Oh my god. There you go. 
Oh! Dude's pretty good with those throws. Alright, I'm hurting. Oh. Alright. So, if that's an indication of the checkpoint distance, game's fair. Can't get in there yet, but we can see the switch that we need to hit. Oh, I have different projectiles now. There's some fine points for the uh, the arc of that new weapon that I don't quite grasp fully. No! Oh, my face! Alright, so it wasn't an upgrade so much as you just pick up, like, different projectiles as you go. That's fine. I can, uh, I can work with that. That's a very Rygar animation right there. I like that. Get out of here. Punk. Down an A. Oh. Okay. Oh, secret area. Oh. Oh, I have no health left. Look down. Press right stick to... Oh, okay. That's pretty good. So you can use the right stick to figure out what's below you before you blindly jump. I do appreciate that. How about you come back up? Okay. Okay. Go, 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 go! Oh! I need that save. Whew! Alright, so far, not bad. And I read about this game a tiny bit in the reviews, and I guess it's a very small development team. Nope, oh, get back here! Okay. I'm a little concerned that if I just jump down after it, I'd jump to my death. But hey, I just saved. Oh! Okay. Oh, they go through the walls! <sighs> Back to ye old forest. Alright, well. Now I have to go down there. I've, it's become a personal mission to take out the stupid bats. No! Oh my god! They have taken the most common enemy in all of video games and made them freaking invincible. Get him! I mean, there's probably nothing that way, but... I gotta know. You know? Aw, oh, I can't throw it! Oh, Go, go, go! Oh my god! No! I don't think I can make that jump. Ah. <sighs> Alright. Once more into the bat-infested caves. Ah, one hit. Alright, so... Yeah, I'd never be able to make that jump. What's this way? Ooh, an apple. Alright, so an app it takes about two apples to recover one hit, so... Ooh, that's a new projectile there. I can go through this door. I can get stuck in a wall. Snake castle key required. Alright. And there's some eyeballs waiting for me. Well, if I go down this way, it's pretty clear that I can't get back up. Oh my god! Woo! Dude can take a few hits.
Oh man. Oh no. Just die. All right, so we are not going that way. Oh, boomerang. Oh. <sighs> Ooh. All right, that's where we're at. Nice chunk of meat. Well, that'll kill you instantly. Go now. Whew. Oh, my face! You and your stupid axes! Oh. All right. Locked? All right. Do I go down the hole? <laughs> no, I do not. <laughs> so, if I can't go that way, do I have to go down? Maybe I do. All right, well, down it is. Get him! Oh my god, run! Stupid bats! Okay. So... Let's see if I can jump over this thing. <laughs> Wait! Oh, three eyeballs. Okay, kill the three eyeballs. That makes sense. Okay. I think I got this figured out. So my theory... Ah! Oh my god, my face! Wait till this guy stops throwing. There we go. I'm pretty sure this is it. Oh, I got you now, buddy. No! <sighs> On the plus side, I was right. Really nice if my shield did some blocking. Okay, go. Go, 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 go. Ooh, you can jump off it. Go! Oh, whatever. Okay. Just wait for him to get tired. Kill him! Oh my god. <sighs> All right. That was a little jarring. All right, so it's not perfect. There's a little bit of roughness around the edges in terms of like some of the layout. But if you take my advice and swap out the control setup, it feels much more natural. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's right. How do you like access to the face? Go, go, go. Nope. Ah, yeah. Alright, I'm getting the feel for this. This did not take long to kind of get into the rhythm of it. It's definitely tough, but it doesn't feel unfair about it. And if you're a fan of retro games, I mean, hey, this is a much better Conan than Conan for the NES was. Ooh, new music.
I sense danger. In the name of Almighty Hegma, whoever brings the head of the Red Dragon will be given 1,000 gold coins. Black dragons should never be touched. 100 gold coins will be given to those who bring one of the magicians who serve the light, dead or alive. Those who say Hegma is not a god will be beheaded. For each snake you kill, you will be given 5 gold coins. King Uldar. Okay. They sound like bad dudes. Well, I'm not going to show much more of this, Chris, because I don't want to ruin it for you. But you know what? For eight bucks? Oh, shoot. Disappearing, <laughs> disappearing platforms. Whoa! Okay. For eight bucks. This is a good time. Anyway, next time. That one's going to fall. Hmm. My guy's aim is terrible. 